top 10 richest yahoo boys that we have in nigeria in the year 2024 giddy guys and welcome back again to my youtube channel in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the top 10 richest yahoo boys in nigeria people that have scammed a lot of persons of their hard earned cash this very video does not in any way support yahoo yahoo activities or fraud or scamming this very video is made to tell you that not everyone you see spending money lavishing money on luxurious and extravagant lifestyle made it through the legitimate means stay tuned as i take you through the top richest yahoo boys that we have in 2024 at the number five spot we have abdul rahman kayode popularly known as Raman jago abdul rahman kayode was born on the 18th of march 1990 Raman jago is a socialite he's a philanthropist he's a bitcoin trader he's a fashionista and he's also a musician on the 10th of May 2019, Raman Jago, Naira Malays, Latan Ibile, beast loaded, were arrested in Lakey, Lagos by the EFCC Lagos chapter in connection to money laundry and cyber crime. Their arrest stood as one of the shadiest interrogation and released by the EFCC. Maybe this guy said to the EFCC, cause come on. The EFCC we know today even collect bribes and even defraud themselves. Raman Jago is one of the few Yahoo boys that invested the money he collected from Yahoo constructively. Raman Jago owns a fashion line by name High Fashion. Raman Jago is into Bitcoin and Forex trading. Raman Jago is into the real estate and he's also a model and an internationally recognized fashionista making millions of Naira every month. Raman Jago has an estimated net worth of 20 billion Naira. <laughs> the next person is a nigerian who many don't believe made his money legitimately he is none other than lord lamba kelvin anabogo is a nigerian content creator who many are alleging he's a yahoo boy many persons are doubting his source of income stating that content creators can just amass 10 billion naira or 20 billion naira in a space of two to three years and this was what Lamba did from 2019 till 2023. Lamba has a house in Toronto. He has two mansions in Lagos with lots of exotic cars. Lamba is estimated to have a net worth of 22 billion naira. Next, we have B Naira, Adewale Adeboye, who was prominent during the reign of Raymond Abbas, Hush Poppy, and Woodbury. B Naira was allegedly topping the top five list of richest Yahoo boys in Nigeria during those times where we had Invictus Obidem. B Naira was very smart when it comes to diversifying his channels of income binara currently is engaged in tech cryptocurrency binara also owns a home known as modern day home so all these legitimate investments that binara has made over the years from allegedly money that he got from yahoo yahoo has made tracing by the efcc and any law enforcement agency difficult binara has an estimated net worth of 41 billion naira at the number second, we have Naira Mali. Aside being arrested alongside Zlatan Ibile, Beast Loaded, and Raman Jago on the 10th of May 2019, Naira Mali is known for his controversial tendencies and criminal background. Naira Mali has a history of wire and identity fraud. Naira Mali has been alleged by the EFCC to be into money laundry. According to some of the reports that went viral after the demise of Mobad, Naira Mali was also alleged to be into drug peddling in the streets of lagos naramali has an estimated net worth of 18.2 billion naira the richest yahoo boy in nigeria in the year 2024 allegedly is ishmaila mumfa mumfa has been arrested several times by the escc on counts of identity theft on count of business email compromise on count of money laundry on count on cyber crime but Monfa on several occasions have won the efcc ishmaila Monfa has a registered business in nigeria he has a beauty change business in abuja that clocks in billions of naira every six six months ishmaila Monfa allegedly has an estimated net worth of 51 billion naira the land himself uh, the way things are going right now, I think it's time for us to release all the powers. Release all the powers. Yeah. Uh, I think we should first of all give them a hint of uh, Abido Shaker. Okay, 
the country now that what happened what happen right now. Mm. I think it's time to shake things up. Mm. What you think about Abido Shaker? Mm. It's a spiritual connectivity and connect to high tensions of power. And you know that we're no more collecting right from transformer. We're taking light directed what? from high tension. 2024, watch out. And I will let you know and they clear you what we're going to use to end all this mess. I'm a warlord. Hi. I'm a Dabowski. Hi. Bowse. Epidemic. Pandemic. Hey. Pandemonium. Hey. Catastrophe. Hey. Cataclysm. Hey. Ufonia. Hey. Who are you? <laughs> this is why you are laughing. Are you are you crunchies? No. Are you Mr. Beast? No. It's like you two and Tigina Bas or the get tagged. Get chili before. What do you eat today? Rice. Rice. Stew or jollof? Stew. Eh? Stew. Ask for me young Tigi Jewel such a Tigi Jewel dilute here. High tension. Um, one girl came to after you stay with a lady. Yes, eh? yes. After we stay with a lady, a yes. prostitute. No, eh? no. We're saying it started on 2019 when one girl came to where I live in Enugu looking for a flat. That's what I'm saying. Do you know her? I don't know her. And you say it's not a prostitute. Eh? Now your sister. No. It come to you are where? Where I'm living in Enugu. So I come to look for what? House. So I happen to go be the agent to direct it to That's what I say. The woman, the lady, she what? Prostitute. Mm -hmm.